Because when me and you first got together, it was clearly indicated that you were talking to nobody, that you were fooling around with nobody, and you were doing nothing not really anyway. That cheating. is. Because when I swear I love, I know that I love her. It's your boy Rayon, and I'm back with another prank. All right, guys. So I'm sure you guys already seen what's going on for the title. I got another, I got another girl pregnant, so I'm about to try to do this prank on Brittany. All right, guys. But first, let me tell you guys. So today, I've been out on the road today. I had some showings today, which is the reason why I'm dressed like this. And guys, I had to take the camera today because I had to take some pictures of this new listing that I have coming on the market. So I want to take some good quality pictures with our camera, right? So as I was coming back and I was thinking maybe I could hit her with this prank and tell her like, yo, my ex just called me and told me that I have a child, you know, ah, uh, ah. Uh. And um, we've been together on almost five years now. It's gonna make five years in November. So what I'm gonna tell her is my boy is five years old. So it's gonna, conflict with our relationship and I'm just gonna see how she react. I don't know how she's gonna take it. I don't know what she's gonna do, but guys, I just have, I just, I just wanna see her reaction. So hopefully she don't hit me, hopefully she don't break up with me or nothing like that. I don't know, because I can't control it. I don't know what my ex didn't tell me. You know, I kind of feel sorry for guys that actually go through stuff like that. They wait till the man is already in another relationship and then try to tell him that bullshit. You, you know what I'm saying, guys? So. I don't like that, man. So I'm gonna hit her with it and see how she feel about it. But um, I would never, me personally, I would never want to be in a situation like that. I want to be there for my child from since day one. You feel me? I gotta be there. All right. So guys, let's get right into this prank and uh, let's see how it goes. But make sure you guys, if you like this video, make sure you give it a big, 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 big thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, guys, subscribe and welcome to the Army family. Let's get it, Liddy over here, lit, lit. Lady over here, alright? So let's get right into the video guys. I never gonna hold you for too long. Let's get it. Alright guys, I'm here. Um I'm gonna leave the camera recording and I'm just going in and just sit it on the table, like turn my back towards her so she can't see. Let's get it. Close to the top. Yo, why are you watching the Ace Family without me, son? straight to Brooklyn. I don't know. What happened? I got another girl pregnant. Say what? I got another girl pregnant. What, what you mean? I you cheated a, on me? I don't know, Brittany, but I have a child. Brittany. I don't even know how to feel right now. What do you mean you have a child? Like is it fully grown she or like is she or or is she like now pregnant? Does all that matter? I'm telling you I have a child. No, because I need to know what this timeline is. Cause I'm asking you if you cheat on me and you saying you don't know. But yes, I have a child that's five years old. Five? Five. Where well, I mean you've been going for the five years. I've known you for five years. we we've been dating for almost five years. So Well, huh? I hear what you said, huh? I'm just thinking about this thing, Brittany. I don't know. So I'm asking you a question, though. What, what you said? So you would have cheated on me, because if you're saying that a child is five. I don't know. It could We've be. been almost dating for five years. 
So, know, but it could be earlier in the year before we started meeting. I don't know. But when I met you, you were saying that you weren't talking to anybody. And we already had this discussion before. Well, I was now closing out all my... No, but you never said that Closing before. out all my old dealings. It's about to go down. You know? But you never said that before. When we first started talking, you never said that before. So how come all of a sudden now you're saying that? And it's my ex. It's my ex. Before me and you like really, really started going like real serious. I think we had just met, but we wasn't like together together. We did But we back But then, you know, like So when me and you were in the talking phase, you and her were still fooling around. We were fooling fooling around. It's not like we was talking. Nothing like it just was a random Meet up. It was just, you know, some stuff occurred. I don't want to explain it to you, but I'm just shocked. Like, you're not even going to be, like, you're not, you're not feeling my pain. You're worried about yourself right now. Like, how could you be so selfish? Like, I have a whole child, Brittany, and me, you're about to start a whole family soon. I mean, I just, I don't know, but I just had to tell you, like, I'm now finding out about it. That's why you're the first person I told. I didn't even call my mom as yet. Well, my whole thing is, is that, first of all, you basically had a child while cheating on me. Because when me and you first got together, it was clearly indicated that you were talking to nobody, that you were fooling around with nobody, well, and you were doing that's nothing not really anyway. That's that cheating. is. Because when me and you are speaking, because if you are talking to someone and you're trying to get close to, you know, starting to date them or whatever, that's the that's the starting level. You have to prove yourself, do you not? So if I was texting other guys when me and you were talking, you would not take me serious, right? But it's okay for you to now tell me that now your ex is now pregnant, well, has a whole five-year-old child. That's okay? That's okay. I'm not only worried about myself. I'm not only worried about myself. I'm worried about you. This, I'm worried about you. You're taking, this, you're taking this way harder than expected. I was thinking you was going to be happy. You could be a little happy. Brian, you, you cheated on me. Stepmom, Brian, you cheated. I don't want to do this by myself, and I obviously can't do it with her. We're not, we're not on a good page. Come on. You sure you don't want to be the stepmom? Brian, like first of all, First of all, you cheated on me and produced a child. How am I supposed to feel? Off the back, I'm upset. Off the rip, I'm upset. Off the rip, your head is coming off. Off the rip. You know how hard it is for me to even keep my hands to myself right now? Huh? Right now, I'm shaking. I'm probably going to feel it if you just take it right now. Right now, I'm like... So what if I, what if I just chop off your, like, behead you? Would then, you still feel it? Then you'll just take me out of the whole picture and I might be a little bit more happy because I cannot imagine myself not being there for my child and that's already five years. He's walking already, First he's of talking all. already, been to school, probably got friends already. Come on, son, I missed everything, son. Damn, First of son. all... Man, I'm like upset, son. So we need to do a DNA test. So, Until okay. then, you should, you, should be, you should still want to be with me, though. First of all, first of all, what do you mean she just called you and said you have a child? So you just going to take everything that she says? That's why I'm saying we got to do the DNA test. Think about it. But if somebody call you and say, oh, Brittany, uh, you're going you're gonna to see it. Because this, this ain't no likely stuff to just ignore. That's, that's, that's my whole hood. That's my whole hood. That's my man hood. Come on. I could possibly 
possibly be a father. Yeah. I could be a dad. That's what something that I always that? dreamed of. Being a dad. Well, what you need to do? What? Deny until you can't deny no more. You gonna, you gonna let me do that? Deny until you can't deny no more. And then just forget about it and just move on with you and just have a child with you? I mean, how, you have to agree to do a DNA, DNA test, correct? You gotta, you gotta agree to do one, right? Yeah, but I could potentially go to court though, Brittany. And how you gonna go to court? Ain't no DNA test? Yes, but... You signed for the child? No. You can call her. She can give me like summons me or whatever you can call that thing. Yeah, she can suck. To go to court and then the judge is gonna make me do a DNA test and if I find out it's really mine, that's five years of child support, Brittany. I'm broke. I don't got no money for that. Really? You know how so, much child support, you know how much money they take from your check? It, it, it ain't no 100, 200. They probably take them all half of your whole check. Really? I got bills. Well, I got rent. I got a car. I got exactly. insurance. So right now you don't need no child. I got so you. So play smart and act like you don't freaking know. I been told you need to change your number. How the hell she gonna find you if you change your number? Huh? I can't. I can't believe you're actually telling me all this stuff. I'm being serious. You don't have no money for no freaking for no freaking child, Rayon. You don't. You don't have no money for no child. The only money that you have is for you. So I don't understand what the problem is. So what? what wait, wait, what exactly are you telling me to do? I already told you. To do. So just walk away from the situation? I don't know. Why is it so hard? It ain't like you never met the child. Alright, so what's up then? How you doing? Man, I'm just stop. But I'm being serious. Like you cheated on me though. But I'm just saying that you cheated on me. So we're going back to this now. We just said we're going to forget about the whole situation. Yeah, this but I'm just saying away. that you cheated on me. You know, it's a producer child now. The child's almost five. We wasn't... But... It's not really full out. It's not really fully cheating though, because we was never together. We was just talking. It's not like we agreed and said, okay, we shook hands and then I broke it. We never shook hands and said, yes, we're going out. So in order for a deal to be signed. It was never solidified. So in order for a deal to be signed. It has to be agreed on both ends that we're together. That's not cheating. I mean, maybe I lied saying that I was fully Brian, messing with nobody or anything like that. But I just came from the gym. And I need to go and take a shower. But I'll tell you one thing. Guess what? What? I saw the camera the whole time. <laughs> what? <laughs> I couldn't believe you, son. I ain't gonna lie. I was like, damn. I was like, damn. How you gonna tell me to walk from a job? It's not like somebody saying, oh, Rayon, you lost the deal. Oh, walk just walk away from the whole situation. Nah. No, we're it's not walking away we're from talking no about here, You gonna take care of it, but me and you gonna be in some stuff and because you lied. She guy, she agreed to be step mommy. She loved me, oh, baby. Ryan, did you I ever? No step mommy. I don't no. know. I'm messing with you. No. You ain't gonna be no step mommy though. But you lied to me and you cheated know, on me, right. so that's gonna all be right. a little okay. difficult. Okay, so what if I didn't cheat on you, but I just had a child that was seven years old? Okay, that's fine. Then you then you agree yeah, to it. Of course. I'll be the bigger woman and I'll be like, okay, you did not know. But it's, not, right? like, but it's not like I did you dirty or anything. Exactly. So can I take ownership of this prank and close it out? Because it was ah, no, no, you can't take my you can't take my prank. Anyways, though guys, I tried. I thought I had her up front because she was going real crazy. But I don't know how she saw the camera. How the hell you saw the camera? Because you said oh, I saw you over here doing something, you and your super self. And then I looked when I was turning around at you. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, I thought I was slick with it. But anyways, so guys, if you like this video, man. Anyways, if you like the video, like I said, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. You feel me? I tried. Still commenting right on down below. But I'm here. And uh, if you're new to the channel, guys, welcome to the Army family. Let's get it. Let's go. We on the road to 5K, baby. Let's get it. Yeah. Peace.